Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it. Nah, eh. no, don't do it. You know side bike, you're carrying bike, pull for you, you won't keep you happy. One, your bike no good. Two, you know Sabi bike. Guys, come on, come on, come on. You, know, you never give me money now. Give you it. You never pay me. Then why they talk like this now? One, this bike now, old bike. Number two, you know Sabi ride back. Or first number two. Guy, I pray I take enter here. Guy, guy, just pull it down, man. When they come, 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 which one be your own? Tell me, man. Guy. Guy, they talk. Okay, okay, okay. Give me my money. Okay, okay. Hold this one, hold this one. Hold that one. Wait, wait, wait. Now, 100 now you they give me. Guy, we agreed on 500. Your guy get 200 bucks. 100 for you, 100 for the boys. Okay? You for tell me now before you attack. Guy, you guy, even if I tell you, no go green carry me. Which one, I no go green carry you? Nigga, hold this money. Correct. No go take Thanks, my guy. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Which one be thanks, man? <laughs> guy, pay me my money. Which one be your own? Okay, 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 guy. Come here. Now, you can be this one. A, J, E, K, A. All my invite my shop today. Guy. Now, from Lagos, I tell the comments, so. Ah, me now, cool. Now, me get this area. Correct. Hey. Only friend I met. Oh, my cool, it down, cool. Ah, go cool, it down, man. Cool, it down, man. See this man. Guy. Hey, hey, wait, 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 Guy! Hey! Hey! Guy, go with you! Guy, come, 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 come! Come here! Sir, carry the person. Come! You're crazy, carry the person. Come, come, come! Guy, give me... I go break this up, man, this one! This one! You're crazy! Oh! Turn up and down, go enter your house! Don't they turn up and down! You know me, guys, I'll be... Okay, I'll be at the house! No, I don't! You're crazy! Yeah, I don't get time, bro! I'll be at my house! You the work I be? I do my house and the work. When my boy is you good day for you, I mean I won't pick this guy for me. Call them now, make them come. I go tell you say now, me be cool. Eh, cool Abi. Cool, cool it down, man. Cool down, oh, cool down, oh. Don't come here. I go take you over. Spoil him. Chief, about that game, you know you just lucky to win. Ah, you keep saying that. You keep saying it's luck, and I get there and I still beat you on that long tennis court every time. 
Hmm? Well, don't sweat it. I'll teach you more about the game later. <laughs> hey, my daughter returned from school. Yeah, she's back. Oh, she's done with her studies now. Oh, she's a graduate now? Ah. Congratulations, man. Thanks, man. I'm so proud of her, man. Yeah. I'm so proud of my little angel. Oh, I bought her a little car to run around in. You know, move her friends back and forth. Because if she's idle, she must have thinking about her mom and mom. And I hate it when she gets that mood. It breaks my heart. You know what, Chief? Hmm? That takes me back to our last discussion. I think you do need another wife. It's been 10 long years since your wife passed on. And we know that you do love her so very much. But you have to move on. Your daughter needs somebody that will play the role of a mother to her. And remember, four years ago, I sent my family to London. And I've never been alone. At our age, we always need a female company. Think about it. You're right, I don't know. And that reminds me too, you know, I've been having this dream. And the recurring dream, you and I, we kept running on a boot path. Don't know who's chasing us. And we always run into, into this room with a candle burning in it. A room? Yes. And there was a candle burning in there. And this voice reminded me of the necklace my wife gave to me. You know what? I've been having the same dream too. You've been having... Of course I've been having the same dream. out here for about two hours. You won't pick your course. Don't you realize that I work? And if I must tell you, I now take my kids to work. So if you've been out here, I'm sorry. You didn't even tell me you were coming to my house all the way from Lagos. W what's the point? Things didn't work in Lagos, so I'm back here. Things like... Please, 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 please. I've been locked here for over two hours. I'm very tired. I'm so hungry, so I need to rest. Yeah. <laughs> well, <clears throat> congratulations, my love. Ruby, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Congrats. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, sweetie, after here, I'll be taking you to the new house. Uh, Ruby, you got yourself a new apartment? Nope. I actually bought a house. A new house. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> You bought a new house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'm, maybe I'm, I'm really, really excited. I'm so happy for you. Oh, you should rather be happy for us. <laughs> yeah, I'm happy for us. Congratulations, <laughs> and we'll say thank God. Yeah. Girl, he's preparing for it. I can't wait to wear my bridesmaid gown. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear that? Baby, 
I hope this house is beautiful. Ah, uh, uh, you just wait till you see it, okay? Are you coming with us? Oh, no, not today. Some other time. Because tonight, you both need to be alone. <laughs> and girl, I'm waiting for food. I'm able. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Baby, once again, I am really happy for you. Congratulations. Sweetie, I think you should be happy for us, <laughs> not me. Because it's not just me going to stay in the house. Ah, it's okay, I'm happy for us. I know, I know, I know. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm ready. We're ready to, to leave? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Ready? I'm ready to go. Sweetie, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys, please. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god, baby, this is this is beautiful. Baby, I love everything I'm seeing. I love the colors. God, you have a great taste. I'm just excited. Well, um, I'm so happy I've impressed you. Come on, sweetie, make yourself comfortable. Sit down. I'm just so excited. Mm, sit down, let me get you something to drink, okay? What Maybe, would you like to drink? I don't think I would want to take anything. I've had enough wine for today. No, no, just no. Just I'm overwhelmed. Come on, you can't say that. This is the first time to a new home, all right? You don't know what you take my offer. All right, if you insist, then I think water would just be perfect. Okay? okay. Water would be perfect. Let me get you a glass of water. Here, here you are, Mr. Lee. Yeah. Thank you. Here you go. Come on, sit down. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. Wow. So welcome to our new home once more. Welcome to my home because this is my home. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Uh, tell me, Sidi, when are you supposed to leave for your NYSC? Maybe in a few months from now. Maybe two or three. Two or three months? Yeah. All right. Well, fine. Now, let's talk. <clears throat> More, yes. Sweetie, you know we've been in this relationship for like four years now. And whenever I bring up the issue of meeting your dad so that I can take your hand in marriage, you always tell me to wait, wait, wait till you're done with your studies. I want to know, are you ready now? Baby, you know I love you, right? Of course I do. And that is all that really matters. Baby, all I need from you is just a little more time. A little more time to be able to tell my dad about us. That's all. Wow. Another little more time. Oh, meanwhile, I'll be traveling to Abuja for you tomorrow on a business trip. But I'll be no. back in two days. Maybe you're going away for another two days? No, sweetie, it's business. It's my work. What does Abuja girls like that? Oh, come on, come on, Fit. Oh, <laughs> what do you Abuja girls? Anyway, just you. <laughs> but you're sure going to have time to call me when you travel, right? Oh, definitely. Right? Maybe I'll call you. Right? Yeah, we'll see you later. Really? Yes, ma'am. So why don't we go upstairs and take a look? <laughs> after you or is it after me? There's food in the pot. If you feel hungry, you can eat. But take a reasonable amount of food. I'm going out. By the time I get back, get prepared because we have to have a little talk. I don't understand why you came from Lagos down here to become a nuisance to me. I wouldn't have that. Because all I'm trying to do is make a success of myself. And I know when I'm a success, that divine flow would go to you. So I don't know what your problem is. By the way, clean up that room. Hey, sis. I, I didn't come back from Lagos to serve as a houseboy. Please. I have a handful. Seriously. Sis. Me, clean up. Guy, I didn't hear you. What did you happen? 
sorry for keeping you waiting. No problem. Let me get the door. You know, you'd have to tell me a lot about Chief. I mean, as his new secretary, I need to know his do's and don'ts. So as not to get any query or worse still, even a sack. I mean, that would be bad. Yeah, but, um, my boss is a very simple man. Is he going? He's not a man with um, too many rules. Once you can be punctual, articulate, and dedicated to your duties, you have nothing to worry about. He is a man that um, takes all his stuff like his own. Wow. Yeah. I mean, he's a very good man. He's not just nice. He's a man that has a heart filled with milk and honey. I mean, the woman that has him will be very lucky to have such a wonderful husband. Well, she was actually. Was? Is he divorced? That would have been a better scenario for her. She's late. Oh. She died some years ago. Oh. Chief. He misses her a lot. Oh. That's so sad. She would have been a very good woman, you know? Yeah. Very nice. Just like the daughter. Yeah. The only child. They have a child. Oh. See, now I really feel her pains. Like, seriously, I understand what it means to grow up without motherly love. You know? It's... Ah. Uh, it's crazy. How old is she? She's in her mid twenties. Mm. So much attached to her father since she lost her mother. This is so sad. It's, I really feel for them. I really feel for Chief so much. Like, seriously, Samson, it is not easy for a man. A man to raise a child without a mother. It's not easy at all. I can tell you that it is he's a he's a strong man. He is a strong man, no seriously. Well, me too. Oh, uh, I think you need to know my place after this. Stop saying. It's getting too late already. Moreover, it's too early for me to know your place. Well look. We have a lot a lot of time to do this, okay? Mm. We work together now, so... Okay. So, uh... uh... So that why are you not in bed yet? In a week. Yes, yes. Um, I am watching the news for updates. Uh, would you want to see something else on TV? No, no. I'm just fine. I think I'll just go to bed after now. Right. Daddy, but um, Daddy. Yes. There's something I want to talk to you about. I've been wanting to tell you this for some time now. Okay. Um, what is it? I know what you want to talk about. You need some money? How much? All right, I'll... Yes, I, okay, I know. That's what we'll do. Tomorrow morning, I will give you a check for 100,000 naira. Would that be all right? I didn't hear any thank you. Oh, Daddy, thank you. Wow, uh, that's my girl. That's it. The rest, just a rerun. Okay, sweetie, it's late. Um, I'll just go to bed. Yeah. You ready to go to bed? Yeah. Alright. Mm -hmm. Come on. I'll see you in the morning, sir. 
good night, I think. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much for calling. Do have a good day. Bye. Hello. Hi. Yeah, I'm going out for a transaction. The boss said you should get him the power plant uh, project for her. Oh, okay. All right, thank you. Thank you. All right, I'll soon be back. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm sorry, how can I help you? I'm here to see your boss. Um, okay. So, who do I tell him? So, before. Tell him his friend, Chief Onuchi. Okay. Hello? Yes, sir. I have a Chief Onuchi here to see you, sir. Right away, sir. Thank you so much. Bye. Okay, you can go. Thank you. So, um, how's your day been? Beautiful, beautiful, my friend. That wasn't bad, neither. Hey, help yourself, man. There are drinks in the, in the fridge. Oh, you know me, man. I don't drink in the daytime unless it's nighttime. Oh, I forgot. Okay. It's a Muslim. Reminds me, you never told me you had a new secretary. Oh, sorry, man. I, it escaped my mind. But she just started uh, a few days ago. Something about her tells me that I have met her somewhere. Think so? Yeah. Get this. Remember some time ago, you and I were driving along, uh, we were going towards the, the, the university area, and then at the junction, I think it's been raining, and we splashed dirty water on a young lady. That's her. Man, she looks so decent now. She looks beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. I called for, you know, for position opening here and she showed up for interview. And she did well. So, one of been a secretary in my office. <laughs> you know what? I see the hand of God working here. What do you mean? <laughs> That's the wife I was talking to you about. Oh, Onuchi. Come on, my friend. We barely even know her. Chief, that incident is enough for you to confirm that she's a good person. Uh, no, no. That singular incident is not enough to know that she's a good person. Let alone be a wife. Come on. You need to give it a shot. Give it a try. All right, I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Plus, man, I, I don't know. I don't want to do something that will hurt my daughter's feeling. You know what? I see something good in her. That's my word. Now look at you. Mm. Mm. You missed me that much. Isn't it obvious? You are the first girl I called as soon as I returned back to the wow. town. Really? Yes. Okay, I have a confession to make. Confession? Yes. I actually came back because of you. <laughs> no, I'm really flattered. Don't be. I brought you something. Yeah. Okay. You seem to have lost some weight. My dear. Lagos wasn't easy. Hustling and thinking of you all joined together could kill any man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, however, you're here and I can take care of you. I know. I brought you a wine. Wine? Yeah. <laughs> wine. wine. Your favorite. Okay. Oh. This is it. Thank you. 
I have got everything I need. Alright? And that is you. You're well, all that I need. Well, my head is really swelling with pride. Now I'm going to show to you how much I love you. <laughs> this sweet lingering. <laughs> love, come on. Uh, come on, I am not running away. And your sweet sister, and your hostile sister will be back. Oh, come on. Baby, please, please. No, no okay, okay, please. okay. Let's, let's pop the wine. Let's pop the wine. <laughs> no, I don't. It's all wine I want. No, it's you no, right no. now. This is your favorite, remember? Tell me what your name is, I would confirm your name. Um, well, I don't follow protocols. I'm so sorry, ma'am. Please, I'm trying to be polite. I do not want the security to come take you out of here. Get out of my way. Hello? Can somebody tell me what's happening here? Um, she, she won't tell me who her name is, so I can confirm her in. She just wants to back into the empty office just like that. Lady, this is an office. Introduce yourself. Oh, oh, I get it. You want me to introduce myself? Okay, take it. Oh, come, hello? Is there anything wrong with you? What is wrong with her? Why should she talk to me like that? Who the hell is she? Why? She's the new secretary to this office and she's trying to do her job. Do you have any problem with that? Will somebody tell me what is going on here? She just slapped the secretary trying to do her job. Is that true? I was only trying to ask her her name so I can confirm her in by you. And she couldn't even want to introduce herself to me. The next thing I saw, she just, she just hit me. Young lady, did you do that? I don't have time for any explanations. I think I'm in the wrong office. Sorry. Can you be Sorry. Do I get it, please? No, 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 no. Just, just, just let her go. Hmm? It's okay. I'm sorry. You, you, may, you may leave too. You may leave too. You may leave. know how to tell your dad that a guy you've been dating for four years proposed marriage to you. But this is ridiculous. Ojali, this is not as easy as you say it. Okay? Look, my father loves me and I love him too. Okay, and I would really want to marry Doko, but the truth is I just can't find the courage to walk up to my dad and tell him that I'm about to leave him soon. That's the fact. And I need you to understand. Takifa. Yes, dear. Do you know that Itoko is ready to settle down? I know. And he's the kind of man every woman is dreaming for. Yeah. There are lots of adventurous girls out there who are ready to take this opportunity to just snap it and be his wife. Considering the fact that he's rich and handsome, he's... Why don't you want to... I don't know what to do. I'm so confused. Well, um... I need you to summon courage and take him to meet your dad. Okay. And after that, let every other thing sort out itself. I'll try. I don't want you to try. I want you to do it. I said I'll try. He's a man every father would want to meet. I don't know why you're delaying it. I don't even know why you're okay, refusing no, to I said it. I'll try. Okay?
Banging on the door like, like, like that. You should have knocked. You are not ashamed of yourself, huh? As a total disgrace that you are. Is this how you squander the money I gave to you? The huge sum of money I gave to you to, to take to Lagos? Is that how you squandered it? Sis, sis, hey. stop, oh, stop. I'm warning you now. Oh. If I start, this house will be hell for you. Ajika, let it be hell. Ajika, let it be hell for me. Tell me, let it be hell. Do what you want to do. Do your worst. You're not ashamed of yourself, Ajika. Take it a girl into the same room that you and your sister sleep in. You are not ashamed of yourself. Sis, I'm warning you. I'm warning you. You are pushing me too hard. Hey. You are warning me. Yes. You are warning me. Yes. Look, by the time I count to three, and that girl is not dressed and out of this house, and I step into that room, Achke, you will see what will meet you right now. Nothing. 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 I'm sorry, it's, it's my it's my sis, please. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the embarrassment. Relax. Oh. Relax. Wait. Come on now, relax. Am I not expected to get married someday?
Well, dad like him. Will he approve of him? Introduce yourself. Oh, oh, I get it. You want me to introduce myself? Okay, take it. Oh, come, hello? Is there anything wrong with you? What is wrong with her? Why should she talk to me like that? Who the hell is she? Why? She's the new secretary to this office and she's trying to do her job. Do you have any problem with that? Ajika, we have no father, no mother. We have no relations. Just the two of us. Tell me. What have I not done to make you a success? <laughs> what have I not done to turn you into that brother that I want to be proud of? I even sold my body. I sold my body for you. Gave you the money to go to Lagos for business, but you squandered everything. And you came back here, picked up the stupid lifestyle that you left behind. Now I've gotten a new job. And I'm trying to make a living out of myself. Ajike, what do you want me to do? What? You know what? I'll be just selfish. I will be selfish. I will do only the things that pleases me. I will live my life for just me. Ajike, I tried. Rubbish. Ajeka, talking as if you have given me the whole world. You are talking as if you have done the biggest thing that nobody has ever done for a brother. See, cool leader, man. Life is, <laughs> Life is good. Hey, sis. One <laughs> Are you okay? Like, you were so lost. You didn't even notice me coming. Yes, I'm okay, my dear. I just threw it in my thoughts for, for a minute. It, it's nothing. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Yes. <sighs> so how about you? What are your plans for the weekend? It is Saturday already. Like every other day, no new plans. I'll just go back to Jali's house to see her. If not for the girl, how would I have been able to cope with this loneliness and boredom in this house when Adeji is running around for his examination? I said we didn't write any exams. It's all right. She's a good friend. Yeah. On a good day, I will reward her for being there for you. But <laughs> don't tell her yet. I want that to be a secret. Because I want it to come Lip as seal. a surprise. Good. Good. <laughs> I promise. I won't. So what is it? I know you wanted to talk to me. What is it? Hmm? So that I am your father. If you cannot confide in me, who else will you confide in? Talk to me. Daddy. Yes. Daddy does. Let me just spill it out. I think it's better you spill it out. Daddy, there's this guy, there's this guy that I've been dating for like 
employers now. Okay. And he says he wants to marry me. But I told him to wait until after my studies. All right. And now that I'm through my studies, he wants to meet my dad. Is that what is bothering you? Daddy, I don't know how to tell you because um, I don't want to get you upset. I don't want to get you angry at all. It's all right, sweetheart. Hmm? It's all right. You bring it. Bring it to me. <laughs> really? That you mean I should bring him to me? Bring him. Let me meet him. And let me see if he's man enough to marry my daughter. <laughs> Daddy, you're just so sweet. It's all right, darling. It's all right. Bring him, let me with him, okay? Daddy, thank you. It's all right. Mm, that's my baby. Someone is coming here to take away my baby. <laughs> Meanwhile, run along and tell him uh, I dodge you to, to hurry with the food. I need to eat something. Hmm? How did you start? Daddy, thank you so much. Sorry about what happened last time, please. It's fine. What? I actually wanted to explain what happened the other day to you. You know, I, I got a tip from someone that my boyfriend comes to his friend's office with some woman. It, it's the same blog, but different office. You know, out of my um, jealousy and anger, I, I got it all mixed up. I didn't go to the right office. What happened was that when the two men walked out of the office, I realized my mistake. So, out of embarrassment and shame, I just had to go. Please, um, uh, I'm sorry. It's all right. I forgive you. Thank you. Thank you. So, uh, you, you live around here? Yeah. Up. Up there? Mm -hmm. Okay. I stay around too. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry. My name is Adigo. Absolutely. I'm sorry. I have to run to the market. Okay. Uh, thank you. So, um, maybe you can get to come to my place and I come to yours too. Yeah. Never to hit me again. Yeah, I would. All right, thank you. <laughs> so tell me exactly what happened. Well, I walked up to him outside where he was sitting. We got chatting and then I brought up the issue. Okay, what did you say? I just told him there was this guy I've been dating for like four years now. He wants to marry me and I said he should wait until after my studies. And he said? He said I should bring him home. Ah! <laughs> I told him. I, told him. Just, I am so excited. I'm just overjoyed. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Oh Thanks to you, anyway. What can I do? Mm. What's our friends for? I think you deserve a big hug for this. Mm. Thank you so much. Mm. Thank you, dear. Thank you. So, have you told your fiance about it? I've been trying this number for like two days now. It's not connecting, but I don't know what the issue is. Um, well, that's not a problem. I think uh, maybe where it is, the next one is not too good. Yeah, I think so. But we're going to break this news to him as soon as he gets back. I see if you know what I plan doing. <laughs> You're always ahead of time. You, this girl. Next on point. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, I'm happy for you. <laughs> <laughs> 